good. See, now that's not so that's shifted. Not yeah, 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 yeah I know what's up. As soon as you hit play, I was like, what's going, you know? It hasn't been locked in. What did you say, 100 mil or something? So you're saying that latency changes with how many tracks you have armed? And no, not how many tracks you have armed. This is the problem. It, Cubase must disable in the I.O. of the ASIO everything that you're not using when you go to track, right? Because no, if I, I, have, I have the more in I.O. I enable or disable within Ableton's preferences, the more latency is introduced. Yeah, see that, and that's that, that's that's, right. that's happening in the background with every program, though, Joel. I know, but, but why Ableton isn't meant to be a tracking? PDC it's not wizard. Meant to record, it gives you a record button and it gives you access to input. How come it doesn't give you some way to have the latency compensation done? So I don't know, you... dude. I don't live in Berlin. Okay, well, there's got to be something I can find in there that. Nah, does. fuck it. Like no, because I'm going to port what over if... back to Cubase anyway when we get the console. Yeah. And I'll just use Ableton as rewire if I have to, which is going to sync perfectly. Right. So fuck it. Who cares? Okay. I'm just saying, like, but there is. So there is. You're telling me there is a uh, direct monitoring function within Ableton. You just choose not to. Use no, it. no. There is no direct monitoring within Ableton. That's what the That's problem is. That's why you have to deal with this latency. Yeah. Problem. There is an option for reduced latency when monitoring. But not no latency. No, but what I'm asking you is why, despite the monitoring, why is it not landing in the track in time? Because it's that, fucking Ableton. It's well, I don't know. I gotta I gotta get into that. Program. Ableton is not Cubase. It's not Pro Tools. It's not Logic by a long You're shot. Right, it's not Logic because I mean, like it should be landing. <laughs> I know, in time, but it's it's not a tracker. It Ableton Live of, Ableton Live was developed in mind. So that you could perform, perform. stuff, okay. click-based things, I know right? That. I it was know. never even meant to be a fucking multi-track dot by a long shot. Okay. It just so happens to kind of be workable as one. Right. You know, so it's kind of funny because, you know, I perform live with fucking Cubase and I track with Ableton. <laughs> which is totally fucking stupid. But it's just, it's, I know. Well, that. because Cubase <laughs> is more robust sure. playing, you know, your Simpty out and all that all shit. That. And it's going to fucking lock. And Ableton sometimes, you know, right. wigs out and crashes or whatever, you know. Okay, 